the bat signal is out. It looks like Joker's calling card is in Batman's hand. Batgirl's shown up and what's Robin doing cooking sausage? Find out next. Same bat time, say, ah, forget it. This is a Figsdale update. Let's get started. Hello, everybody. This is Dr. McBrick, and I am here with Figsdale City Update number 44. That's right, 44. We're only six away from 50, and we are going to have a huge celebration when it comes time for Update 50. We have so much stuff planned. We have a lot planned for uh, today, actually, to talk about. Um, so let's get started. First of all, I'm going to zoom in a little bit, and as I start talking, you can see that uh, our... Uh, Eastern Figsdale area with our Chinese Temple Fair and uh, the Ninjago docks are still um, where they've always been for a while, for several months now. Um, we have the mock that I made right there. Um, the building that has the uh, public bathroom also has a, a shop above it and a, a little pigsies shop. Um, that's the back of that. And of course I have the uh, Temple of Air Jitsu which is sitting here. Now again my goal is to put a mountain right through here so you don't see the entrance to the house and stuff like that right there um, that goes upstairs but anyway so yeah so it's basically all the same everything is still there um, you see all of the uh, fair goers that fair is never ending um, that sort of thing uh, let's move you over here and let's show you um, a few things. It looks like our pizza guy is uh, sitting down on the job there. It looks like he's been delivering a lot of pizza. Um, and you see all this white space in here? Um, I know that uh, one of uh, my uh, Patreons and, and, and fellow supporter Samuel says, you know what, you need to use your white space a little bit better. Well, I promise Samuel I will get more, um, more and more stuff into this particular um, area and there won't be so, many, so much white space and all that kind of stuff. But you can see down there are the shops and the little apartment that I built. Um, <clears throat> Spidey is still hanging on there. Um, not really sure what's going on there, but he's going up there and he's headed up to the helicopter. Um, something's happening up there. Um, all right, so let's see what else is going on here in Figsdale. You know what? We, we focused on six figs so much in the past um, couple updates that uh, um, we haven't talked a lot about Figsdale because not really a lot is going on. Wait, wait. The donut shop or the donut drive through and it looks like, oh, it, <laughs> it's a stormtrooper. And uh, it looks like Hans Molman is ready to get there on the uh, donut drive through um, Nothing else going on there. Looks like they parked their tow truck there. Uh, they're selling pumpkins at the Quickie Mart, so if you need a Quickie pumpkin, you can go over and get one. Uh, there's some folks over there. It looks like our um, bank robber has been apprehended. Remember how in the last episode he was running away? Well, he's back there in the yard, um, and they have him contained playing some basketball. The construction workers are hard at work still building that police mock of Adrian's that he started a while back. And here... Uh, this guy, oops, sorry about this, not very steady, I apologize. Um, that guy there looks like he's had a little bit too much pizza pie. Um, <laughs> and there's there's a, a Farrakis going on over here. Um, you know what, I'm going to flip around here and see what's happening over there, because that looks interesting. Okay, as we come back over top of Figs Lanes, I still do not have my roofs on this building, and I apologize. I know a lot of people are like, what about the roofs? And there's Pigsies back there in the alleyway. I'm going to uh, fill all that in. We have the construction workers that are still working diligently on getting that new police station up, and Adrian is working on that. But we want to see what this chaos is going on over here. And it looks like there's a problem with the parking lot attendant. It looks like... um. Oh my goodness, it looks like they're having one of the henchmen's uh, vehicles stolen. And Lord Business and uh, Lord Garmadon are there. Lord Business, Lord Garmadon, all the... Oh my goodness, they're all there. And they, they are giving that parking lot attendant some grief. But you know what? That parking lot attendant is not going to budge. I'll tell you what. And there's some people there dining at the hot dog cart and our snack cart and everything over there. So that's really cool. Uh, let's go around here and uh, we can see it looks like Pigsy and... Uh, the monkey kid are coming out of White Castle. They just had some uh, um, castles there, and uh, they're getting ready to uh, go. There's still more construction over there because we're working on bringing this road all the way through here. Now, you see where Apocalypseburg is, of course. Now, Apocalypseburg is going to move to the other side of the city. 
Um, but until then, um, it's still going strong. Oh my goodness, it looks like our friend Bart Simpson is getting arrested. Um, <laughs> oh no, it looks like El Barto there um, is, uh, has painted the graffiti um, on the uh, wall to the basketball court. And it looks like none other than Slimer is dunking himself a sausage and the basketball all at once while the NBA sits back and watches. Um, really cool, really cool there. Sorry, Bart, you have to go to jail for uh, your art. But uh, you know what? That's what happens. That's the fig life. Flipping back around here, you see we're on the other side of the White Castle, and there, of course, the Monkey Kid again. And they're still working. Wait a minute, is that Fred Flintstone working the forklift? Wow, well, I'll tell you what, Fred's going to do anything he can to earn a buck, and certainly has. Um, and again, we want to thank all of our healthcare workers and all of the folks who are working really, really hard on that vaccine, like Dr. Frank right there, to come up with something that will eradicate this virus from the face of this earth. So let's keep on going here and see what's going on in Figsdale. Donut that's that, they're getting some uh, hipster juice and uh, getting it all set up and uh, getting their morning coffee and things like that. Grandpa's still out there sitting on that bench reading his paper next to old golden pants. And there's a guy who's going in to uh, uh, launder his money, evidently. Let's go around here by Smitty's Auto Repair Shop. Oh, and it looks like some folks are having some fun using the dolly there. Um, oh my goodness, what is this? It's a hearse. Hey, that's not good. Um, a hearse is pulling into Figsdale and driving up. This must mean that something is coming and something is happening here in Figsdale. I'm not really sure what's going on. It looks like Ron Burgundy, former anchorman, is still standing out there with Tim. And then all of a sudden I hear honk. There's an Oscar. Aw, there's a poor little Oscar just sitting there right by the movie theater. Huh, I wonder which one of those films won an Oscar. If you can tell me, tell me down in the comments. All right, now let's see here. Oh my, there he, <laughs> there he is. The king himself, Elvis Presley, ladies and gentlemen, and Priscilla are hanging out and they're driving in that sweet, sweet pink Cadillac that Elvis is so fond of. Bubbles is always talking about Visit Six Figs in Figsdale. She loves Figsdale. Um, coming around here to the park, there's the bookseller. He's standing out there. Um, looks like the chickens are uh, just kind of hanging out, the chicken family. That's awful nice. Um, anything else going on up here? Oh yeah, I want to definitely to remind you to uh, wear your mask when you're out in public and wash your hands, sanitize your hands, and keep a social distance of uh, um, three to six meters uh, as far as you can. Um, three meters, six meters, six feet, nine feet, 10 feet, however far you can do it. Um, but anyway, just uh, keep your distance and max, mask up and uh, let's, uh, let's help each other out, will we? Um, and it looks like we have, there's Big Al sitting there. Um, I don't know if he's getting ready to get his hair cut, if he's getting ready to do some risky business there. Um, and then it looks like, uh, it looks like Nana and Papa have gone to visit Mildred because they haven't seen her in a while. Um, hey, is that Hedwig back there? What's happening there? Um, it looks again, oh my goodness. It looks like the Hogwarts Express, <laughs> the Hogwarts Express has run over Dumbledore. And uh, oh my gosh, there's carnage going on back there. Not really sure what's happening back there, but let me tell you what will be happening back there. You see right now it's an empty space. Well, I have two Ikea tables, two of them, um, brand new, and I'm going to put back here. And uh, let's see if I can uh, zoom out a little bit. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, uh, there we go. Um, and what I'll do is I'll put two Ikea tables back here, uh, and that is going to be the uh, Diagon Alley. And like I mentioned on the last one, uh, I have a uh, about 600 of those red masonry bricks that are gonna go back here. And those red masonry bricks are going to form a wall that will be the wall going into Diagon Alley. Right where you see the Hogwarts Express is going to be the entryway for the platform. Now, right now, whoa, I have the platform sitting over here, nine and three quarters, but that is going to be flipped around and uh, that will come over here and uh, it will take up residence right here. So it'll come right over here. Let me see if I can get around here. See where that grassy knoll is right there. That's where the uh, platform will come and attach to and there'll be a sidewalk right there. And then where all this is, that's going to be Diagon Alley. So you'll actually be able to uh, have a gate 
and that gate will open, you know, and the and and I'll have a kind of a scissor mechanism so that it will open up, um, and uh, and you'll be able to uh, um, to to open it similar to the way that Harry Potter and and Hagrid opened it um, in the movie, but it's not going to go, you know, every which way because I just can't do that. Um, and uh, so anyway, and then of course I promise, and a few people have asked, when am I going to finish my last building on my space station or my space uh, um, research center? I promise I will get that now that I have the tables coming back here that will stretch back here. There'll be more work back here with the space station, with Diagon Alley, and then the airport, which will be going back here as well. So anyway, let's take a look more and see what else is going on. It looks like a, there's a new firefighter there at the uh, firehouse, Scoob. Um, it looks like he's doing pretty well. Um, let's just kind of zoom in here and uh, see what else is happening. Um, that's really cool. There's some folks going on over there, some people on their bike. The street sweeper is still over there. Um, and uh, they parked the cars finally. Oh, restaurant God. here, Taco, Taco Tuesdays. It looks like the Beatles are coming. And uh, so the Beatles are getting ready for, um, it looks like it's Fiesta Friday, to be quite honest with you. Um, and that's happening here. Um, what else is going on? Oh, my goodness, it's a serenade. It's a beautiful seaside serenade on the Bay of Figs with the Simpsons. And uh, Josh, who is playing on the guitar there, serenading them with a nice, beautiful, beautiful stingray, that nice new stingray that came out in 2020. Um, and uh, it looks like uh, um, that night will just not give up his castle, no matter how hard he tries. Um, back on the boardwalk, we have Flanders <laughs> with a chicken. And uh, he's got a chicken leg. Not really sure what he's doing. Um, Willie, of course, is back to uh, unplugging the toilet for uh, the Mexican restaurant here. Um, that's kind of a, uh, a rough thing to be doing there, Willie. Um, and then we have a guy who is a Ford guy standing there. Now, over here, there's a bunch of things going on over here, a family reunion. And of course, since we are just a city of plastic and we are fake, we don't have to social distance when we're seeing our family like we do in real life nowadays. But uh, Joey and, and his friends are playing there. It looks like Caitlin is up there in Little Mac Bricks' house and Little Mac Bricks is over there. Um, they're pulling out of the driveway, getting ready to go somewhere. But what is going on at Batman's place? They got the bat signal out um, and they have a, a Joker's calling card and Batman is is uh is there as well as batgirl and um and and robin is cooking sausages i'm not really sure what's happening there something is going on the joker remember from the last episode the joker's helicopter was up there it's no longer up there anymore so i'm not really sure what happened to it but uh something's going down something's going down there i'm not really sure uh Let's see, on the slide, we have the banana guy <laughs> going down the slide. Somebody's getting ready to dive. And oh my goodness, oh my goodness, Zabadok, Zabadok, what are you doing, my friend? You got to stop it. Oh my goodness, you're going to lose your hat again, Zabadok. Zabadok is catching a curl out on the Bay of Figs. Way to go, buddy, way to go. Um, let's zoom in over here and just kind of see what's happening. Just trying to give you some real good looks this time at some of the stuff going on and some of the detail that we have here in Figsdale and Six Figs. There's a guy with his lobster roll and just enjoying some time. There seems to be, um, oh, there's some divers and stuff like that in the water. Oh my gosh, what's going on here? The, the Coast Guard boat is going out. A whole bunch of people are going over here. <gasps> oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh my gosh. First of all, we had Dumbledore get hit by the Hogwarts Express, and now we have a shark eating a diver. Oh my gosh. I guess um I guess the diver was looking in the binoculars and she didn't see the warning on the binoculars that said things in these lenses might be closer than they appear. Um and uh, what are those stormtroopers doing up on the coaster? It looks like they they're going somewhere. I wonder where they're going over here on the pirate coaster. Whoa, wait, there's a Jedi. Oh, and there's there's another stormtrooper hanging on for dear life. We have three Jedi's up there. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! It looks like the 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 sharks don't care don't care whether or not they're the Sith or whether they are the actual um, actual uh, 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 rebellion um, or Jedi's or who they are. But uh, um, oh my gosh! <laughs> There's a good battle scene going on right there, right before our very eyes. And look, here come the troops! Here come the troops! Um, wow! How about that? Down below here, getting ready to get on the ride, is a uh, is another person, and he's not looking too good. Um, now, if you recall, we had put this up here um, last time. We had built this particular set um, and uh, and put it out here onto this water, and we started to curve this. Now, we haven't done anything else, but we'll curve that fence all the way around. Uh, and then once we do that, um, you see that we have our extension to six figs. Now... 
I added a table there. I'm going to add a table back there, um, back there. And then there'll be another table back there. The problem is you see that pinch right there with the shelf. Um, because I have my shelves of everything going up back there. Um, and there is a pinch where I, there, I cannot add any more tables. The other thing that happened was, and as you see everything here in Six Figs. Now I've showed you Six Figs a lot for those of you that have followed me. Um, and so you know that there is a lot of stuff going on back here with the coasters and, and all of this great stuff back here with the medieval village and the entrance to Six Figs and all that sort of thing. And you can come in and there's Hadrian's Wall back there where you exit and all kinds of castles and, and the haunted house and the Joker Manor is back there, of course. Um, and we have all kinds of rides and, and kind of the, the midway right here and, and with the Ferris wheel and the Hot Shot shooting gallery and the carousel and the slum. So basically what I have done is I have locked myself out of this whole area of Six Figs. I can't get back there. I, I have a grabber, actually, like one of those grabbers that you hold and you grab things. I don't know if I'm going to have to use that or I, I do happen to know that this, if you look closely here, um, this, this, uh, these base plates come, come, you see the line going all the way up there? I don't know if you can notice, but the line is actually right there. So I can take these tiles off and I can make it so that the tiles match the base plate and then all I have to do is slide the table. Um, that's what I'm going to have to do because I can't get back there right now. So that's... <laughs> It's the, it's the Sig Fig slide, evidently. And we have Kaz Mockett, who is going down on the slide, followed by me, Dr. McBrick, going down on my stomach. And there's Greg from GJ Bricks. It looks like somebody's going to win. I'm not sure what's going to happen, but if I keep going on that trajectory, I'm going to shoot out that middle and hit the rocket guy over at the Hot Shot Shooting Gallery. Um, <laughs> Now, one of the things that we did as well is we made sure that we had the uh, train here because this train, remember, is going to come around and this is going to be a table right here. And uh, they'll, you see where to connect. There's the curve right there that goes right there is where it's going to be. But this train comes back here and we just made sure that this train missed the mixer. So it, I thought at first it was just a couple studs, but it's probably about five studs, I think, that it misses. So it's still going to scare the crap out of somebody as they come by. Um, and that mixer's going and the train comes speeding by and everything like that. They're still working on that mixer down below. Um, so you can see everything going on here in Six Figs. A lot of stuff happening. Oh, it looks like the uh, Monkey King is over there. And they're getting ready to go into the uh, Haunted House uh, drop ride here. Um, that'll be fun. Um, what else is going on here? Not much else. I'm going to just zoom it out one here so uh, you can see a little bit more of Six Figs as we go through. Oh, we did add the Raptor from the uh, Rex Celsius set. Um, or the, that's uh, the, the, the uh, oh, I can't remember what set it's from, but it's, it's from the Lego Movie 2. Um, apologize for that for not remembering that but uh, it's getting late here and trying to get a few things done um, so anyway so we did add that um, over here we still have our uh, jurassic park world and everything like that we have uh you know the the jurassic park uh coaster here that kind of the the gondola ride that kind of goes through the park comes through the park comes around here and there's no one queued up for the ride right now but they ride in those cars oh yeah you see somebody coming through right there um, the tree house is, is attached. Um, again, just for those of you that haven't followed me before, um, we're going to have the Ewok Village that comes around here. And as you see, we're starting to build the Moss Isley Cantina. That Moss Isley Cantina will be in an L shape right here. There'll be a mountain coming back here. The train will go through it and go under it or behind it. And then we'll come out here by the western area. Now, the reason I'm doing this is because, you know, Moss Isley is kind of the wild west of Star Wars, right? It's kind of a wild west area um, and planet so uh, it, it kind of fits in with the wild west of the real west for the u.s um, and so um, so anyway so I, you can see i'm starting to build it i got all the pieces there all the bags over here in the in the studio where i'm in my build area um, you see i have all the bags there and everything like that i got them queued up to build over there and everything uh, so everything is all set to go um, and uh, as you can tell I'm just kind of busy get, figuring out how I'm going to get all this in here um, and I did make and for those of you that haven't seen the video which is the last video I posted I did make this particular um, part of the Moss Isley Cantina into the Jawad Junk 
gift shop. And uh, the gift shop, of course, holds all kinds of, uh, um, of Star Wars merchandise. And so plus Six Figs merchandise and things like that. We're going to put some more uh, merchandise in there. I also made this particular building here. And I apologize. I'm trying to get tangled up in my cords here. I made this particular building into a bathroom. And so uh, this is uh, part of the Moss Eisley Cantina, but I had to make it into a bathroom so that that way inside um, you can see that it's actually, well, I'll lift this here to give you a little, little more light. You can see that it's actually a bathroom. So that way, you know, they need a bathroom on this side of Six Figs, they'll be able to go into it and uh, work uh, whatever business they need to take care of, right? Um, <laughs> so anyway, um, that's what's going on at Six Figs. Uh, let's see, I'm just gonna keep walking around here um, and see if uh, anything happens. Now for my Western village, um, my Western area, it's all smushed together right now because I have to wait and see Moss Eisley and get it exactly right. I'm going to put some of the side builds that are attached to the side of the cantina. Um, I'm going to put them in that white spot there and, and fill that in with, with sand um, and uh, maybe like a little even sand dune and stuff. Um, so maybe the dewback will be back there, that sort of thing, uh, to kind of go with the, uh, the dinosaurs in a sense. But once all that's done, then I'm going to spread out and I have Ewok Village to come through here as well. That'll be my next project. Um, um, after uh, Diagon Alley um, and then that way uh, I'll have Ewok Village then I'm going to spread out the west and the west can come around here we have the train um, you see the train track going all the way back through there um, and everything like that so uh, there's a lot to put in um, in this western village so I still have to figure out exactly what I'm going to do now I haven't changed anything over on this side of town or on this side of Six Figs as you see the back of the Joker Manor, it is still there. The Simpsons are still there visiting Joker Manor. Joker's back, his uh, helicopter is parked and uh, he's back around somewhere. Um, there's still some people. Uh, the original Catwoman, Julie Newmar, is back there uh, coming around uh, the coaster. And of course, we still have that wonderful uh, sideshow that you can watch um, with the Riddler and his gang and uh, Itchy and Scratchy. Uh, you can see them up there while you are waiting to get on to this coaster ride. So um, anyway, that's what's happening here. Uh, we have up here on the coaster some people going to, ready to go across on the coaster and things like that. Um, now back here is going to be more neighborhood. Um, my neighborhood, you see I have Privet Drive, the house that I did. I did a video on that. It's actually become very popular. I think we have like almost 10,000 views on this because I actually built it in and built the whole house as opposed to just the uh, dollhouse build. But anyway, we have two more tables to add back here. We're going to smush the residences together and we're going to add some more buildings back here. There's going to be a right here in this corner, right here, from here over to from here to here. Um, will be a hotel resort for Six Figs. So that way when people come to Six Figs, they will be able to see it. And now I did a video um, a week ago or so. It was a kind of a uh, the mockability video that I did. Um, you can check that out here. I'll try to remember to put a card up. Um, but it basically shows that I'm going to take three of the Marvel... Um, uh, Avengers Towers and I'm going to make a hotel out of those as well as add the friends set um, pool and resort that they have for that just came out in the summer and so this will be one big resort area right here and then these houses will be smushed together a little bit more um, and uh, um, that sort of thing now I hear tell oh by the way here is our Lego land discovery center of course and there is no roof on it again that's just one of those things i still have not put on it and i know i get flack from that every time um just as an aside over here are a whole bunch of buildings that i need to put up that will go in the city itself um you see even the upside downs back there um, part of the upside down i got the, the the real what i consider the real haunted house right there the monster fighter house and the, um and that sort of thing so yeah so i have a whole bunch of stuff to put up um whoa coming around here but um i just haven't put it up yet word has it that once the before the resort comes in uh kaz mocket from blockhead uk is going to make her house into a bed and breakfast so it's going to be the blockhead uk 
bed and breakfast. <clears throat> Maybe the bed and blockhead breakfast. I'm not sure, um, but it's going to be something like that. So, uh, so anyway, and there's a beautiful look at the Bay of Figs um, as we come around. There will be a table here. Um, that will come across as well, uh, and that will uh, that will provide more bay of figs, um, so that we can we can uh, have some boats out there and and do some more things like that. So you can see everything that's been going on. Um, hopefully that uh, oh my goodness, what's going? On? <laughs> it looks like Buzz Lightyear is still gone a little farther than normal there, um, and that's good. Uh, there's a whole bunch of stuff happening in the and you know what? It's funny because sometimes the kids come down here and they put stuff in the in the in the city, and I I don't even know sometimes what's uh what's in the city and and it just kind of surprises me so i'm just trying to you know sometimes i i don't see all the stuff that they put in and when i see all the stuff it's like wow i didn't realize that you had you know put that in there um but there's a lot of jokes going on up here like for instance what the heck is this guy doing up here what is he spying on that's what i want to know um but uh yeah there's a lot of stuff that goes on that sometimes i don't even see uh so <laughs> It's hard to tell. It's hard to tell what's happening. What's going on over here in Apocalypseburg, for instance? I'm not sure. Anyway, that's about all I have. Hey, you know, check me out on Patreon and check me out across the socials because I am available across the socials. Um, I am available at Dr. McBrick just about anywhere you want to be in terms of Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Flickr. Um, I'm everywhere, to be quite honest with you. We really appreciate all that you've done for us and our family in terms of the support and the comments and, and all the Patreons and everything like that. We just appreciate helping us out and, and, and giving us great ideas and inspiration. And really, you all are the inspiration for what we do because we really, really enjoy um, building this, uh, this, this city and uh, the theme park. Um, and as you can tell, we've uh, gone a little bit, and this is probably my doing, we've gone a little bit crazy with the theme park um, because, uh, um, well, it's just a lot easier, to be quite honest, to build sets and to take any set that you that you that Lego comes out with and to make it into a theme park. You know, it's a little more difficult to incorporate stuff into a city that has buildings and things like that. But the great thing is that you can take things like the Moss Eisley Cantina and you can make it into a part of your theme park. So that's what we've done with Six Figs, and that's what we've done with uh, um, with with our theme park. So we've tried to incorporate as much as possible. Um, so hopefully it's coming along. Hopefully you enjoy what you see. And uh, with that, this is Dr. McBrick signing out.